for the work we need, the stabilized donor blood, void blood, the capillary on 0.02 milliliters, bariatric chamber, cover glass, a glass tora, 3% solution of sodium chloride, rubber tube, spray bulb, alcohol, cotton wool, test tubes, and microscope. The curtain chamber is a thin glass plate with four troughs in the middle. There are three narrow stripes between them. The middle stripe is 0.1 mm lower than the others and divided with a trough. From the two sides of this trough there are the meshworks of bariatric. Each meshwork consists of 225 big squares, 25 of them are divided into 16 small squares. At first, clean the chamber and the covering glass with the cotton wool moistened with the alcohol. Dry them. covering glass on the center of the chamber. With the help of thumbs, move the covering glass back and forth till the appearance of the colorful rings of Newton. Leave the prepared chamber on the table. Take the pipette for 3% solution of sodium chloride. This pipette is on 5 ml. We should take the solution to the Mach 1. Then put all the solution into the test tube. Take the capillary with the mark 0.02 ml from the plate. Connect it with the rubber tube and fix the spray bulb with the tube completely. Take 0.02 ml of donor blood into the capillary. Add 0.02 ml of donor blood on the bottom of the test tube with sodium chloride so that the upper layer of solution will remain untainted. Raise the capillary slowly, clean it with the sodium chloride solution, then dry it. Put the capillary on the plate, then slowly mix, uh, slowly reading the test tube, mix its stuff. Take the obtained solution into the pasta pipette. Bring the tip of the pasta pipet or stora to the body of the covering glass and the chamber. Put a small drop of the solution on the middle stripe of bariatric chamber. It will run under the covering glass under the influence of the force of capillarity. The excess of solution is removed with the help of cotton wool. Take the microscope, light the field of view. Put the condenser absolutely down. Put the central part of the chamber exactly under the objective lens. Count the erythrocytes under the large increase. 
in five big squares situated in different places of the meshwork in diagonal direction. For counting, use the rule of Yegorov. Only the cells lying inside the square and on the left and upper borders belong to this square. All the other cells not. The number of erythrocytes in one liter of the blood is calculated by the next formula. Our result matches the norm.